Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Recently, Indian Army has released three important requirements regarding which we are going to discuss. The first one is acceptance of necessity for procurement of 252 6x6 gun towing vehicle. These vehicles will be used for towing 155mm artillery guns and air defense radars. The second one is for 91 high mobility reconnaissance vehicle HMRV which will be employed by command and reese elements of mechanized infantry units and armored regiments for reese and surveillance tasks. The third and the last one is for the procurement of 113 electric buses along with 43 fast chargers. 60 out of 103 buses will be for army and 46 for air force and remaining 7 for the navy. Talking about the gun towing vehicle, it is going to be a 6x6 high mobility vehicle to 255M artillery gun and air defense radars. The GTV should be able to tow a 20 ton gun or radar. The vehicle will have a payload capacity of 8000 kg or more including the weight of crane. It will accommodate two crew including driver and co-driver in the driver cabin and minimum six person in crew cabin for gun detachment. It will have an ammunition handling crane with hydraulic or electric drive with minimum 2 ton capacity. The ammunition crane should have capability to lift 700 kg ammunition pallets at a reach of 2.8 meters. It will also feature a power driven winch controlled from driver's cabin to self recover the GTV and the gun of up to 20 ton through soft patches of sand or slush. Talking about the HMRV, it will be employed by command and reese elements of mechanized infantry units and armored regiments. It will possess adequate mobility and provide protection for troops on board. In addition, it will be able to carry the battle loads includes weapons, ammunition, surveillance and communication equipment required to carry out mandated operational tasks. HMRV will be operational by day and night and in commonly encountered weather condition at high altitude of up to 5000 meter altitude or mountainous terrain including snow bound areas. HMRV will also be a 4x4 right hand drive vehicle with all round protection. The protection will be from side walls, doors, underbelly, windscreen, side and rear glasses and will be able to withstand a direct hit of 5 rounds of 7.62 by 51 mm ball fired from 30 meters. It will feature roof mounted traversing guns hatch with a traverse angle of 360 degree. It will also have a provision to integrate surveillance equipment and a weapon mount mounted on a hatch or cupola with 360 degree traversing capability for bringing down the effective fire. The HMRV will have two in-service radio sets for communication. It will also feature a digital map displayed in a visual display unit which will be a combined satellite and inertial navigation system compatible with Navic, GPS and GLONASS. It will be able to carry payload of not less than 1.5 tons and will have cruising range of minimum 400 km on road and 200 km in cross country off road. The vehicle will have on road speed of 80 to 100 km per hour and 35 to 45 km per hour in cross country. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.